Transformational and Sustainable Change. One Community Weekly Progress Update, number 104. One Community is a 501c3 nonprofit organization. We are creating open source and free shared blueprints and resources, tools and tutorials, and do it yourself instructions for highest good living. Creating solution models that create additional solution creating models in the service of all life on this planet. This includes highest good approaches to food, energy, housing, education, for profit and non profit business creation, society, and true earth stewardship. We are creating all these things to be implementable as either individual components or as complete teacher demonstration villages and hubs. Welcome to the One Community Weekly Progress Update. My name is Jay Sable and I'm the Executive Director of the One Community 501c3 nonprofit organization. This is our weekly progress update number 104 completing two years of video updates for me without missing a week, and we had written updates before that, but two years of video updates on One Community's Progress. This is the February 27th, 2015 edition. As always, I'm gonna be covering with video and pictures all of our team's accomplishments and progress for the last week. If you'd like to see more details, more specifics, links, to all of the open source content, tools, tutorials, resources, everything that our team is creating and has created, uh, you can visit our written blog. Now, if you'd like to receive an email every time one of these updates comes out, you can send an email to onecommunityupdates at gmail.com and we will add you to our newsletter list or you can subscribe to our YouTube channel. Let's jump into the updates. One community's approach to highest good education is open source and free shared, Designed for all age groups, adaptable to any schooling environment, inspiring and fun for all participants, a learner, teacher, collaborative, and it includes U.S. Common Core Standards. This week, the core team, which includes the Pioneer and Satellite members, plus those helping us who don't wish to be individually acknowledged, finished another 30% of the Technology and Innovation Molecule graphic. You can see that here, and this brings us to 70% complete with this image. Behind the scenes, we also finished brainstorming the bullet points for the final 50% of the technology and innovation section of Violet. In addition to this, we finished the second 50% of the human body themed lesson plan webpage. And this lesson plan, which you can see here, is now done and can be used to teach all subjects to any learning level in any learning environment using the central theme of the human body. Behind the scenes, we also finished the next 20% of the next lesson plan we're working on with the central theme of civilization. This brings us to 75% complete with this lesson plan. If you'd like to help with this education program, we are seeking people to finish these lesson plans. We've got them all outlined and we're just looking for the creative minds who would like to contribute something amazing to the educational world through our open source and free shared education program for all ages and all educational levels. One community's approach to highest good food is duplicable almost anywhere, scalable for different needs, more biodiverse and nutritious, part of forwarding a global open source botanical garden collaborative, and includes nine different free shared and duplicable growing environments. This week the core team working on highest good food added the first complete recipe from Benjamin Sessions to the food self-sufficiency transition plan page. You can see this recipe and photo here where we've also created a separate section for omnivore meals that can be made vegan versus the section below that is vegan meals that can be made omnivore. We also researched and added two resource sections to the Open Source Turnips Hub, the Open Source Oka Hub, and the Open Source Mashua Hub. In addition to this, Sandra Solani, vegan chef and author of What's Your QB, created this new fiber smoothie recipe that we also added to the vegan section of the Food Self-Sufficiency Transition Plan page. In this area of our open source project, we are seeking permaculturalists, an irrigation specialist, a surveyor, and a chef to join our team as either consultants to the project or pioneers who will be moving onto the property with us. The one community approach to highest good housing is eco-artistic home building that is affordable, sustainable, do-it-yourself duplicable, resource and space efficient, and consists of seven different sustainably constructed village models. This week the core team working on highest good housing 
continued laying out the specifics for the open source Murphy Bed Furniture assembly details behind the scenes. These are part of the Earthbag Village and the crowdfunding campaign plan, and new updates included cutting lumber and labeling pieces for the smaller shelf and ladder and assembling the smaller shelf and ladder. What you see here is all this behind the scenes work in progress, and we estimate we are now 45% complete with what is needed for the website. Also behind the scenes, we finished another 15% of the Earth Dome window and door framing reformatting details needed before moving these specifics to the website. This brings us to 90% complete with that work. And we also updated all the headers for the crowdfunding campaign open source details pages. Here's the collage of all these newly designed headers. We also updated the materials cost details on the Earthbag Village materials page and added the furniture cost details, which you can see here. In addition to this, we redesigned the Eco Bathroom and Shower Open Source Hub. Here's a picture of the new additions there. And we added another 20% of the amazing work and calculation details from Samuel Soroister, permaculturist and sustainable designer from Green New World. The new sections you see here are sections 2 through 4, including primary plumbing details, hot water system details, and the details of the gray water recycling for UHET flush toilets. We'd say we're now about 30% complete with adding the ongoing work Samuel has been doing over the past couple months working on this. Last but not least, Scott Thomas and Shadow Ridge Signature Architecture Program team also finished putting the Earthbag Village Shared Accommodation Student Dome Designs into CAD that you can see here, and the Children's Dome CAD Designs you see here. Both domes feature double beds and open floor plans for maximum central space availability. In this area of the project, we are seeking a master plumber and a master electrician if you or someone you know would like to help with this component of our open source creation process. One community is also creating an open source duplicable city center. It is designed to be LEED Platinum certified, provide 12 guest rooms, dining for over 150 people, and laundry and recreation space for over 300 people, all while saving money, time, space, and resources. This week, the core team completed the first 15% of the thermostatic shower valve and heat lamp energy and water savings open source page. This included creating the header, basic layout, and the what and why sections of the page. These systems will be used for both the Duplicable City Center and the Earthbag Village. For this area of the project, we are seeking a structural engineer and a general contractor. The structural engineer is somebody that we're seeking to help us design the cupola so it can be built without a crane, which is very important for our open source goals and duplication anywhere in the world. And the general contractor is needed for assistance in conjunction and collaboration with P2S Engineering, who is helping us with the mechanical, electrical, and plumbing section of this structure. The one community approach to highest good society is globally focused, individually enriching, cooperative and collaborative, includes a highest good network and application, four different economic models, and combines fulfilled living and true earth stewardship for the benefit of all people and all life on this planet. This week the core team created this new terms and conditions page that outlines the terms and conditions of using one community's site and the open source content we're constantly creating. This is a culmination of several weeks of work with our legal team. We were also featured on Thrive this past week, hosted by Foster Gamble, who you can see here. We shared the interview with the founders of the New Earth Nation and the Ingenuity Innovation Center, and you can watch the whole overview video on our written blog. Also, we added the beautiful work of Paige Allison Donatelli, graphic designer and owner-operator of Namaste Living in a Material World, to the One Community Pledge page. This included a redesign of this page and a plan to feature it next week. Page also helped create this header for our People's Agenda 21 Protecting Human Health page. Behind the scenes, Jin Hua, internet marketing expert and web developer, also helped us set up individual page editing on our site and created the initial outline for a video tutorial to teach people from other countries with no web design experience how to help us translate all the different pages of our site into other languages. In this area of the project, we're seeking graphic designers, web designers and technology specialists, videographers, and building a highest good legal team. If you or someone you know fits these descriptions and would like to join our highest good society creation process. Transformational and sustainable change are possible if enough people want it, and if it's easy enough, affordable enough, and people have the time and energy to put into it. And so one community is here to create exactly that. 
The idea of open sourcing and free sharing all the tools, tutorials, resources, blueprints, do-it-yourself instructions for all aspects of highest good living, which covers food, energy, housing, education, highest good economics, which is for-profit and non-profit business creation, fulfilled living models, as well as true earth stewardship. By open sourcing and free sharing all of those different components, we are here to help create everything necessary as well as a living example that people can experience and visit of a teacher demonstration community village city and hub that can be replicated anywhere in the world and this teacher demonstration community village city and hub is designed specifically to share all of those open source blueprints tools tutorials and resources with others to teach others how to replicate and build their own teacher demonstration community village city or hub while simultaneously contributing to the global collaborative of open source blueprints, tools, tutorials, and resources too. This is the idea for transformational and sustainable change that we see as a truly viable option for transforming the world into a place that, that works for everyone. To create the world that we know is possible. We have the resources, we have the technology. What seems to us to be missing is a really easy to follow, affordable and attractive enough blueprint so that the model and the idea of transformational and sustainable change that benefits everybody and everything on this planet can grow and evolve and reproduce on its own. So this is what we're up to. This is our idea of taking physical sustainability and combining it with emotional sustainability and putting these together as a comprehensive sustainable model that creates a living environment that most people will consider to be far superior to the way that they're living right now and where the way of life itself not only contributes to the greater good because it's sustainable but also provides the time and space in people's lives to really really consciously and proactively invest energy in helping share their own abundance the things that they've helped create the global collaborative that they would be a part of with the rest of the world helping to multiply and make more efficient and better the whole teacher demonstration community village city model so that more people can duplicate it too. If this sounds fun to you, if this sounds exciting to you, this is what we're up to and we invite you to join us and get involved in what it is that we're creating. The only thing that is holding us back and we are moving forward unbelievably fast is participation. We're looking for more people. We're looking for more individuals that carry the consciousness for the highest good of all that want to participate and help create what it is that we're doing by donating, volunteering their time, becoming a part of our vol all volunteer organization, joining our team as the core group, the pioneer team that will move onto the property and help build everything that is one community and multiply our open source creative process a hundredfold. This is the team that we're building. And the idea of transformational and sustainable change that can create the entire that can create a new world for everybody that can transform the whole experience of living that can address simultaneously address all of the primary foundational biggest challenges that humanity is facing right now: food shortages, hunger, starvation, uh, homelessness, lack of energy, social inequality. All of these things can be addressed simultaneously, and we think they need to. Because we see them as not only interrelated, but also interdependent. And so the complete model that we've created, combining the physical infrastructure with the emotional infrastructure, is designed specifically to do that because that's where we see transformational and sustainable change coming from. And that's where we see our ability to create a permanent solution. So people ask all the time, they say, well, what's the, what's the number one thing that we could do to help you out? Like, this sounds like a great idea, but how can we help one community? How can we make this happen faster? Of course, the number one thing is we're looking for large-scale funding. Our whole team is nonprofit volunteers, so our overhead is very, very low. But what we need to do is we need to get the property off the market so that we can share the location of the property that we've been working with now for four years. And so we can multiply our team very quickly and efficiently, probably five, tenfold in a period of a couple months, because if we could share that location where we're going to be building, the number of people that would be able to join us because they would finally have that solidarity and that knowledge would exponentially increase. And so if you know somebody 
If you're connected to somebody with resources, if you happen to be somebody with those resources that would like to either donate to our 501c3 nonprofit organization or invest in our nonprofit organization and our goals, we would like to talk to you. The second thing is to share our information. We are on all the different social media networks. Our favorite social media network is Sue because we think that it's a higher consciousness network and it's doing something really revolutionary and different right now. But we are also on Pinterest. We are on Twitter. We are on Facebook. We are on Tumblr. We are on Reddit. We are on all of the delicious. We are on all of the different social media networks, 10 more at least that I haven't named right now. And sharing our information on those social media networks helps to get the word out helps other people to find out what it is that we're doing so the people that have the time, the people that have the energy, the people that have the desire for transformational and sustainable change can join us, get involved, become a part of everything that is what we're creating. We have put in tens of thousands of hours into the creative process right now and we have created amazing resources. Our food infrastructure is ready to go, a lot of our housing infrastructure is really close, we've created um, a multitude and a diversity of open source blueprints, tools, tutorials, and resources, and we continue to work on these every single day. Our team continues to grow weekly, and our productivity continues to go up. It's only a matter of time. It's only a matter of time. So, as always, thank you for following our journey. Thank you for being a part of transformational and sustainable change with us. Uh, if you'd like to receive a weekly update every time one of these updates comes out, you can send an email to onecommunityupdates at gmail.com. If you'd like to see more details, more specifics on everything that I've talked about, links to all of our open source content and the specifics of this blog and our most recent blog, if, uh, if you're watching this in the future, then visit our written blog and... Uh, as always, thank you for following our progress. Thank you for the small donations that we get because they help to pay for that overhead. While it is low, it is still something, and so that helps us to continue to move forward as well. And, of course, uh, until next week, we will keep on keeping on. Thanks for following our progress.